Hello, this is special edition on eBooks of Digital World. Our guest today is Professor Abuki. Welcome, Professor. Thank you. Professor, currently more eBooks are sold by Amazon than hardcover books. How can you explain this sudden demand in eBooks? Well, eBooks have been around for some 40 years now. They haven't been very successful so far because most people would not even consider reading a book on a computer. However, the mobile revolution with devices such as e-readers, iPods and other tablets has changed a lot. The experience of reading is much more like reading a paper book. If people don't like reading on screens, do e-books have any advantage over traditional books at all? Of course. E-books have a variety of features that make them more convenient to use than traditional books. You can carry hundreds of books on one device. The devices often have integrated research features such as a dictionary and web search. Many readers now have automatic syncing. That means, you can read a book on a smartphone on the train, for example and then continue reading at the very same spot on your tablet when you get home. Some readers even have text-to-speech integration. What is your favorite feature of eBooks? I would definitely say searchability. I have hundreds of books on my bookshelves. However, when I want to look up something I am much faster finding the right book in the right passage on my e-reader. One problem with eBooks is their rather high price. They are often not much cheaper than the paper version. Do you think this is going to change? I am pretty sure. The competition among the major mobile players, such as Amazon, Apple and Google is very fierce and will drive prices down. The costs of selling an e-book are only a fraction of the costs its paper version. So, a drop of prices can be expected. Is it possible to get very cheap e-books now? Yes, there are thousands of e-books in the public domain which you can get completely free from websites such as Project Gutenberg. There are even a lot of free e-books on commercial sites, such as Amazon. What are current trends in e-book publishing? Currently there is a strong trend towards publishing e-books as mobile apps. One reason is that e-book standards such as EPUB 3 are still under development and lack many technological features of multimedia and interactive apps. Another reason is that it is easier to monetize apps than other forms of electronic content. One final question, what will the future of ebooks be like? The future of ebooks will be in open formats which will be able to integrate with social media and learning management systems. The current generation of young learners will probably look back and wonder why it took so long for e-books to take off. Thank you for coming to our show, Professor.